The 15th season of Night Hoops jumped into action for another year. The anniversary event was celebrated by past, present and future members with a special award given to Gordon Hogue who founded the Night Hoops program. Thank you for coming out today and for having such a great vision and a great idea. I was the director of Willingdon Youth Detention Centre and I was looking, uh, sitting in my office at one point looking at the statistics in terms of offences by young offenders and over 90% of them were at late at night and it seemed that we didn't have a lot of programs in the evening. Night Hoops seemed like a logical way to do that. Our goal was certainly not excellence in terms of athleticism. Our goal was a good citizenship, being engaged in and, and being engaged with their community and caring about each other. And those, I think, are the stories that are most important. For feeling good about themselves and feeling like they were participants in a community, participants in a team, and the first step towards that was, was being part of a team. Steve Anderson, the Night Hoops program manager, continues to develop, promote, and encourage young people to get off the streets and onto the court. Okay, hey guys, thanks for coming to the championship event and playing in the program. Uh, we've got prizes for you guys. But when I get into the gym and I see the kids playing and I see them competing and having a lot of fun, wearing a Night Hoops jersey, representing their community center or neighborhood house, it, it's really great. And we involve kids from uh, you know, some that don't have anything else that they can do on a Friday, Saturday night. Some, some don't have a lot of parental supervision. We're able to give them a safe place to be on Friday, Saturday night with a coach who cares about them. Kids can go to their community center and ask, when's night hoops starting up? Do we have a team here? And, uh, and then, you know, through the youth worker at the center, they'll, they'll fill out the referral forms and, and get involved in the program. Um, the beautiful thing about that is in night hoops, there's no tryouts, there's no cuts. You just have to love to play basketball and want to be part of something. The day closed with some local youths taking on the Vancouver Police Department. But it wasn't about the score, it was all about having fun playing the good old Canadian sport of basketball. Well, maybe a little bit about the score. For The Express, I'm Charles Bosio. Good job, good job. <laughs>